Hey guys, what's happening? Welcome back to the shop once again. What we have here is a 4.6 liter two valve cylinder head from the back side here. You can see this is the one we put the spark plug insert into it. We pulled the heads off a few months later and we're doing head gaskets on them because the 4.6 is prone to head gasket failure. And sure enough, this one had a couple bolts that were loose and that's why it failed. Um, but while it's off, I figured I would show you that insert we installed. That spark plug insert that goes down into the head that we reamed and tapped and installed. Okay. Now you can see in the back side here, because like I said before, there's a lot of misinformation out there on tapping and threading it, well, reaming and tapping it, and how far down to go. And it just goes to show right here, you can see it comes at the very edge right here, that my instructions were indeed correct, and it brings it all the way down into here, and it's a nice, clean installation. The other thing I wanna show you, up bring up here in a second is how many threads there actually are in a stock cylinder head and the reason why these blow out. But also, there's a few questions out there, a few people that question using a high temp Loctite on the outside of the threads to hold that insert to the cylinder head. Uh, they keep saying that basically it's just gonna melt and get gooey in there because it's not gonna be able to handle the heat. Now this one from TimeCert is supposed to be able to handle 500 degrees. So since this head is coming is, is off to do a good machine shop for head gasket uh, check, um, we're going to pull the spark plugs out. So we're gonna do it right here live in front of you and we'll see if the insert comes out or just the spark plug. Now ideally with this insert in there becomes part of the head and with, you know, of course using the proper sealant like this it should definitely be part of the head for the rest of the life of the vehicle so in the future when you do spark plug changes the spark plug should just come out by itself so let's go ahead and try it out all right so there it is we broke torque on it and you can see the spark plug is just coming out by itself there you go. You can see it right there, spark plugs out, and the insert is still inside of there. And that just goes to show the sealant really does work. I like it a lot better than the JB Weld, uh, for sure. It becomes part of the cylinder head. Let's show you real quick. Get you down inside here, a little focus action here. You can see the insert, real nice install. No jagged edges for any hot points in the cylinder. And I'll bring you up here to the stock threads on the other cylinders, and you can't see it. Eh, maybe that one. You can see there's just a few threads in there, and that is why the spark plugs truly blow out. Whereas look at the insert down here. There's a lot of threads down in there. So these will never have a problem again once they're installed. 